So I'm gonna do another one of those videos where I do my makeup on camera because it makes it easier for me to talk and go about my business and talk more naturally on camera because I'm doing something else. Anyway, I'm not talking naturally right now because I'm not doing my makeup, so let's just, I'm gonna do that. Anyway, it's snowing outside today, so my classes are canceled. Um, I still have a, why is this not wanting to focus on me? Okay, I still have a, a therapy session to go to because um, I have anxiety and I need to talk to her about it, but that's not till a little bit later and I think I'm only getting ready so I can go to like a coffee place. The foundation I'm using today is uh, this thing. Whoop. It's the uh, Maybelline Fit Me thing. Anyway, drip it right on there. The class I was canceled today, we were just gonna watch Vertigo, or finish watching Vertigo. And um, I've already seen that multiple times, so no big loss for me. That's kind of how film school works. You watch the same like Alfred Hitchcock movies over and over and over again. This foundation's a bit light. Um, light as in it doesn't cover up much, not light as in light skin tone, because I already have a light skin tone, so all the foundation I buy is light. But um, I got this guy here and a couple of this guys, so I don't want to cake anything too heavy on, or it might just make them worse. This morning, I bought, ooh, they're behind me, uh, bought Vampire Weekend tickets, because those went on pre-sale today, and I made sure to get a pre-sale code, because I don't like to take chances, especially when I've been waiting to see this band since, like, late middle school, early high school, and I've never had the chance to do it, so now that I have the chance to do it, I'm very excited about that. I'm now going to use a powder to set the foundation. It's the Glossier powder. Anyway, yeah, I haven't been able to see them even though I've wanted to for a really long time. So I'm finally doing that. Uh, not until September, like late September, but uh, nevertheless, it's happening at some point. Um, next thing I'm using is the Fenty Beauty Highlighter in the color Confetti. It's a light, like purpley white color. Yep. It looks nice. I like it. I like having a sparkly face. So anyway, Vampire Weekend is not the only thing going on in my life. Um, I did an interview yesterday to work at Cannes, so we'll see how that goes. The guy said I had a nice application and that I seemed nice. Keegan's texting me. Cool. Yeah, I learned back about that on Friday. So three days from now? Um, I would like to know if I'm in, because that's a, it's a big one. That's a big trip <laughs> to plan, so yeah, but an exciting one. That would be really, really neat. Anyway, moving on to my eyebrows. I got this sample, like a lot of my makeup, from Sephora. It's the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel, and it doesn't really do that much. It just makes sure that I can comb these little guys. I'd also like to point out, I'm wearing this shirt today, which I used to wear all the time when I made videos like two years ago. Um, it really puts me back in the frame of filming stuff again, which I get a kick out of, even though I don't know how good I am at it or like what anybody who watches this gets out of it, but I don't know. I think it's fun. I like doing it. I'm just gonna keep doing it until I'm bored of it again, I guess. I'll probably do other video formats other than like this. I would like to film more when I go out with like friends and stuff, because um, I think my friends are funny and cool, and I like to document them because I think they're special. Moving on from that, uh, I'm using the Modern Renaissance palette for my eyeshadow. I'm gonna go with this sparkly one up here. Vermeer is what it is called. And it's there. I definitely think this video isn't going to turn out as good as the last one that I did. So maybe I'll stop doing these get ready with me's. We'll see how this one turns out. I'm going to go with a darker lip thing today, which is this one by NYX. Got it at Target. It's called Transylvania because it's like a dark purple color. Ooh. All right. Doing that in the viewfinder was not super fun, but I think it turned out okay. We'll see. Yeah, aside from Vampire Weekend and Can, uh, and the snow outside, because I can't go to class, 
Um, that's about all I got going on, but that's a lot going on, I think. I am excited to go to Vampire Weekend. That's gonna be really cool. I have no idea what a Vampire Weekend show is actually like. Um, I think it might just be them standing in front of like a banner with flowers on it. But maybe that was just the Coachella set I watched that one time. I don't know, maybe they'll do something different. It is a whole other era now from the last. So that will be pretty neat. I really, I enjoyed the two singles that came out a lot. I thought they were like different from things they'd done before, but similar enough to previous work, especially like recycling lyrics and stuff, that it was like, oh, they're back. Nice. And the can thing isn't a done deal, so I'm not gonna talk about it too much, because if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. But um, yeah, if it does, I'm sure I'll film it. I am going to do my eyeliner today with this literal tiny Sephora sample. Again, uh, just Sephora brand. It's like a pencil. It's not focusing. It's just an eye pencil. Whatever. The nub's really wearing down, but that's okay. I, I actually think I'm gonna go do this in a mirror because I just tried to do it with a viewfinder and I think it's not gonna look good if I do that, so I'll be back. Back from doing that, um, and while I was over at the mirror, I grabbed a little bit more foundation because I think I would like to cover these guys up. So I'm using the same one as I did in the last video. And my mascara that I'm topping it all off with is the Roller Lash Benefit one, which is my favorite mascara. I think it's really, really good. All right, face is done. Awesome. Looking a lot better than I did at the beginning of this video, minus my hair, which is like really frizzed up over the course of this video. I guess to like sum up this whole video, maybe have a cool job coming up. Um, going to a cool concert, and I live in Portland where it's snowing. Some stuff I did want to sum up at the end here, because um, I know there's people that watch this that may not know what's going on in my life anymore after the two years that I was gone. I moved from Chicago, which is where like all my previous videos were, to Portland, which is where I'm from, because um, Chicago was kind of depressing me. <laughs> the weather wasn't what I was used to. Um, the school I was at wasn't really working for me. I wanted to focus more on academics and it wasn't that kind of school. So I transferred to a different school. <laughs> um, so that's where I am now. Um, and I've been s moving a whole bunch since I've been here. Um, I lived in an apartment downtown. I lived with my parents. I lived with my boyfriend for a while. Now I'm here in the dorms because it's easier for me to commute to class. That's what's going on. Uh, Maddie, who was in the Chicago videos, lives here now. Yeah, if you've ever heard me mention the name Keegan in these videos, that's my boyfriend. Michaela, who I've been making videos with, lives up in Tacoma now, but she still comes down, so I'm sure she'll be around. Oh, and Elena's in Philadelphia. Um, Elena's been in a couple of my videos before, too. Um, and the rest of my friends are down in Eugene. So, yeah, I'm only 20 and I can move around and do whatever I want. For, uh, I mean, not just when I'm 20, I can do that whenever I want, forever, because that's how life works. So, ooh, this is really getting blurry. Cool, maybe I should not leave this on autofocus. <laughs> that's my life. I hope your life's going good. <laughs> um, I don't know when this video will go up, but today is Tuesday, February 5th, and that's what's going on with me. All right, see you later.